Double Den on this fine evening. Hope there's many more to come. Yeah, it's um, it's been a fantastic day. We've had amazing sunshine all day today. And uh, it's late evening, it's gone for seven o'clock. Um, but we've got Blue Sky. And uh, one or two places have opened. Iris Restaurant has opened. Uh, there's a lot of traffic, a lot of cars, a lot of people coming into the resort. Uh, quite a few of those are staff. Um, so we just thought we'd have an evening out, nice stroll down to the front, because we can. And we're only 10 minutes from home, 15 yeah. minutes. Hey! Season's coming. Yeah, so we've been in chat to one or two bar owners earlier this afternoon. If you happen to be doing work on the bars, just we were uh, picking a few bits up, running around the place. So, gorgeous evening. Do you want us down uh, heading towards Flower Street? Oh, there's a few people about. Um, just walking past to Johnny's, to Jenny. And uh, nobody dining outside tonight. There's a bit of a chill in the wind, actually. <laughs> Well, there we go. They're open and trading. You can have a meal. And so it's fairly late on in the evening and we've still got uh, one or two of the stall type shop market stalls open. Uh, if, you, if you're a regular sunny beach, you know once they open, they never want to close. <laughs> I try and stay open every hour they can. Now, uh, saying that, there is one day, one morning in May or June, just as the season gets going, you'll find all the market stalls are shut. There isn't one. You can walk around the resort, there's not a market stall anywhere. And that's the day they do the tax inspections. <laughs> it spreads around the resort and everybody shuts because the tax people are walking around. And it's really funny that for a few hours, that abs, everything's just got going, then everything closes again. <laughs> tax day, tax inspection day. Oh, we're nearly at Flower Street. Oh, so a little bit of a surprise um, at the magic board. And um, actually out the wind, it's actually not too bad, it's quite nice, but the magic board is saying tonight it's 17 degrees at 10 to seven. So temperature is holding up quite well today. So the next couple of weeks it starts to really shoot up and get warmer. So you seem to be bikini weather. <laughs> Obviously I won't be wearing a bikini, but it is bikini weather very shortly. There's a nuisance seagulls. And uh, our friends the seagulls are destroying the bins again. So there's one here. Typical example of the felon. There's a nice tidy bin. And um, he's decided that there's some apples and bits and bobs in the bin, so he's going to have them out. So be aware if the bins do have lids on them, close the lid. Because these little creatures are going to have everything out, like he's done here. Now Susan did a bit of a tidy up. Don't slip on the banana skin. So it's Thursday evening and uh, it's going to be Easter this weekend in Bulgaria. So the Bulgarians will be um, heading down for the weekend. And uh, we just noticed in our apartments actually it's quite funny because uh, a couple of the local have turned up at their apartments for the evening and um, put their air cons on. Well, they actually sound as if somebody's strimming the grass because they're quite worn out. They haven't been run for six months and <laughs> it sounds like the bearings are going. And there's two or three really noisy ones today as they're being fired up for the season. I've sat there and they really could do a bit of grease on them, I think, a bit of oil. Well, there we go. We had a new one fitted. A lot of friends have had new ones this year. And this is, uh, show the other day, the corner bar, the live club. And this was a fantastic open balcony. 
with the girls dancing up there. It's fantastic. Great, lots of noise coming out. Lots of girls. Lots of noise. Lots of youngsters. Um, I have got a stricter the council about noise, so it could be that uh, by cladding it, they're enclosing it. I'll keep going for later. Ah, so here we've got Susan with the uh, Google Translate, which we use all the time because this is in Bulgarian. And uh, it's the corner bar, and uh, they're advertising for chef and waiters and cooks. Cleaners, dishwasher. Cleaner, dishwasher. Basically, um, all the jobs. If you want a board job. up. If you need a job, but you need a few language skills because uh, you have a right international crowd here in a couple of weeks. I only really speak English, I'd be really struggling. <laughs> We're very good at that at all. Well, the last couple of days, there's been lots and lots of flights in from Poland. So greetings to all our Polish viewers and subscribers because uh, I've actually met a couple the last few days. Um, many of them are here actually looking at property. So they're going to be coming back quite regularly. But uh, there's a lot of flights in from Poland at the moment. Oh, I did say the other day when I came up here that the first bar normally to open is the Central. And uh, that is almost there. Menu cards are out. Got little cards out. Tables are all out and the chairs. It's very, very close to opening the next couple of days. Supermarket next to it is already opened. But that is very close now. Tomorrow. There we go. Last minute bit of paint work being done there on the woodwork because they open tomorrow. So that's the first bar really on, uh, first bar on Flower Street will be open on Friday, tomorrow. Wow. And generally there are quite a number of people walking up and down here in the daytime, so they can run a uh, minimum staff for the, for the next week or so need to but uh, just coming to life now from zero bars to a few bars it's getting better <laughs> oh. since last September I've been filming an empty resort basically for months and uh, it, it's it's gonna be amazing that in, a, in sort of 10 days it will transform from a, somewhere really empty with the shutters down to an active active holiday centre. It's a very quick transition. If you're looking across the Nessie Bar, Nessie Bar, there you go. It's beautiful in the distance. The sea's a fantastic colour today. This afternoon is a bright, bright blue. It's really, really nice. Uh, but unfortunately, we've, we've not been down the beach today. We've been to Burgos. Because somebody has said they want me to get the swimming pool up and running in the next couple of weeks. So I've had to go to the pool shop today and buy some materials and uh, then go back next week to get a couple of other bits to finish off. I didn't take the measurements with me. <laughs> I've got the pool shop trying to describe it, what I've got. It was a bit difficult, so I've got to take a couple of bits in change them over but it's not far off from Susan having a swimming pool now a couple of weeks that's all and there we go what a magnificent view that's where we're going to be packed with lilos and brollies in a couple of weeks it's amazing in a month's time you won't recognise this completely different. We're just going to take a walk up past the Condor. Let's see how busy everywhere is tonight. There's many people about. 
Uh, there's nobody drinking outside at Condor this evening. Go inside. A few people dining at Flora outside. Um, about a dozen people are outside having a meal. But it's busier inside. It's not quite season yet. It's about to turn around very quickly when it does warm up very fast. And I've got a list of jobs and parts. Oh, I've got so many parts with so many jobs to do before it gets too hot to do them. So I've got to finish all my work really by the end of May because I won't feel like it then. You can't paint or really do anything because it's uh, everything goes off a bit too quick. And of course then we'll want to be in Sunny Beach in one or two of the bars. Well we might want to be out the odd evening, yeah. <laughs> there are a lot of chemists in Bulgaria everywhere you look. There is a chemist. They also have a lot of banks. Compared with the UK, everywhere you, every sort of high street has a few banks. Which is great, as you can actually get service. Get personal service still. I've actually walked a fair bit of day, I haven't been in burgers, around the do-it-yourself shops. <laughs> I've been dragged out by the other half in the evening, because, oh, the sun, sh let's go out. Let's go out for the evening, have a stroll. First stroll out in Sunny Beach this year. So, we have the restaurant opened yesterday. Uh, here we go. This is Aris. One of the larger restaurants here. Very pretty, all the hanging baskets up. Hedges are cut. And it's actually open. Woo! Started yesterday. Complete with restaurant cat. Hello there. Hello. Nearly all the restaurants got a, a sweet cat sitting around, begging off your plate. <laughs> sitting there going to beg off your plate while you're eating. No, that's a good cat. It's not hungry. That's a well-behaved cat. That's really don't like spending money. Anyway, her indoors, I just said, um, as is our first night, we're going to treat you for a dinner. So we're going into our wrist for a meal. Well, I hope this is going to be good. So this is the outside area. It was covered in leaves and looked very sad two or three days ago. And it's amazing how they turn the restaurants around. I mean, it's absolutely gorgeous now. Completely different to the other day. So I've got uh, a very unusual meal. I've got pork with onions in a nice sauce with, um, with salad. Shallot onions. Shallot onions. And Susan's got a broccoli bake uh, with sweet potato. It's very nice. And a garlic bread here that we've demolished. There's not a lot left of that. Nearly gone. Anyway, we're talking to a nice meal now. Ah, oh, looks good. Look at this new guy. It's homemade. Absolutely fantastic dessert. We're sharing it. We just can't have one each. We'll get huge. <laughs> Gotta stay slim. All that walking and blogging. Got to get in my bikini. And from the um, absolutely really, really nice uh, RS restaurant, here you go. Just have a look inside. Fantastic, um, beautiful restaurant, lovely garden and fountains. Outside's very, very nice. So it's uh, ciao ciao for me. Ciao ciao for me. We're just going to Condor for a night cup. Yeah, one little drink and we'll see you again later. Hopefully the season will be underway properly. Bye-bye. <laughs>